Let's talk about this this morning. You know that we have regulations on drugs and regulations on alcohol in this country. Well, uh, recently there's been some regulation attempts on salt, and now the next thing is sugar. So the question this morning is, should sugar be the next thing to be regulated in our nation? There is a group that's active right now in those efforts because... They say so many people in this nation right. are fat and they're blaming sugar. And where was it written? In our weekly issue, hand delivered to us from yep. Nature Magazine, comes every week. That's right. Uh, and I said, who oh, it's going to, they go right, open up to this, this was earmarked. They say sugar acts in the same areas as the brain of alcohol uh, and tobacco. It encourages subsequent intake, which means once you have a little bit of sugar, you want a little bit more. Yep. It's toxic because research shows that sugar increases disease and other factors that add calories, such uh, that, interrupt, that disrupts your metabolism. So it's a strong argument. The question is, can we make any of our own decisions anymore? <laughs> no, absolutely not. By the way, we should point out that the uh, Sugar Association disputes the science that is quoted in this particular commentary. Do you think they have a, a, an act? Do you think they have <laughs> a horse they, in they that race? They probably do have yeah. a, a sugar horse or a, a horse taking a sugar pill. Mm. Listen, I, I just got to say uh, thank you uh, to these people who have come up with this idea because, you know, I, so many of us, we just don't know what we should eat or what we should think or what we should buy. So it's really good that these folks should come out and say, we really need to start taxing sugar or putting an age restriction on it so that only certain people eat stuff that people have eaten for thousands of years. And the reason that we've come to this point is because there is some facts in this whole story, and that is America's fatter. America is fatter. But the should world it, is fat. Yes, the world is. We all fail to pinch should, So should it be personal responsibility to know how much sugar intake you have on a daily basis? Or should the government step in and make it like a drug and make it like it's regulated? That, to me, is, the, is at the heart of the issue here. It's personal responsibility mm -hmm. in my mind. You start with sugar. Next thing you know, you're going to need ID to buy butter. There's going to be an armed guard at the Dairy Queen. <laughs> It could happen. <laughs> you right. know what? Some people would say this is, a, this is a good argument for why you should vote for Ron Paul. Because you'd have the freedom to have sugar and to be fat. And that would be go. fantastic.